the Abbott family and the Brown family drive to the same beach for their holiday. So this is the beach and they're driving to this beach for the holiday. The Abbott family drives more quickly. The Abbott family drives more quickly than the Brown family. The graph shows the distance from the beach, the distance from the beach D plotted against the time in hours in T. So this is the graph we are talking about. So this is your x-axis which is time in hours and this is the y-axis which is time, distance in kilometers. So let's read the graph. So this I hope you can see. This is zero. This is zero. This is 20, 40, 60, 80, 100 and so on. So this is going up in 20s and this is going in half an hour. So I hope you can see this is this would be going up in 20, so this would be 240. So let's first read the graph. So it's always good to read the graph. So this is three hours. So let's look talk about the blue graph or the straight line. So the blue graph tells me uh, the, gray, uh, the distance of 240 was covered in three hours. So let me write that. 240 is covered in three hours. So the speed is 80 kilometers per hour. 80 kilometers per hour and for the red line 200 kilometers is covered in how many hours in four hours so that is 50 kilometers per hour so that's the speed 50 kilometers per hour so obviously this red one is for abort so I will say this is a this line is for a that is aborts and this blue line is for Browns B. So how far do Browns live? So let's answer this question. How far do Browns live from the beach? So B for Brown. Uh, okay, sorry. I, uh, I should have gone the other way around. Okay, sorry. So this red line, this 240 is for the blue. Okay, so this blue line is for A. Okay, that is about because they are traveling faster. They are traveling 240 kilometers in three hours. So this blue is for Abbott and this red is for Brown. Okay, so first answer, first question is how far away do Brown live from the beach? So the Brown, this is the line for Brown. So they are 200 kilometers away from the beach. Okay, and if some of what's the, how far away is aborts living? 240 kilometers. At what speed in kilometers per hour do aborts drive? So abort are driving at 80 kilometers per hour. 80 kilometers per hour. How long do does it take for Brown to get to the beach? So uh, Brown takes four hours. Okay, just reading the graph, you can answer these questions. Write down the equation for abort's distance d for the beach from the beach at time t. So I'll write d a. d a stands for abort. Okay, the distance with respect to time. Abort, the gradient. So to write the equation of a line, you need to know the gradient. The y intercept is 240 and the gradient is minus 80. So this is minus 80 t plus 240. So this is the equation for abots. Okay, so yeah, every, so they, when time is zero, they are 240 kilometers away from the beach and every hour they're covering 80 kilometers. So this distance will decrease by 80. So this 80 is telling you the speed and when you, this gradient is negative because from left to right it is going uh, from left to this is from left to right it's going down or think in this in terms of distance every hour the distance is decreasing by 80 kilometers that's why it's a negative both families leave home at 10 a.m. which family is closer to the beach by midday now midday is two hours after 10 a.m. okay so yeah by just looking at the graph let me draw a dot. So this is two hours. So this is midday. And let me draw a dotted line to explain what the answer should be. So this is 
the blue line that means the blue line stands for how much? who does blue line stand for the blue is for abort the aborts are 80 kilometers away from the beach and what about browns the browns are how far away so let me draw the line so we don't need any mats here just by looking at the graph the airports is the blue line so they are 80 kilometers away from the beach at midday and the browns at midday are 100 kilometers away from the beach so at midday which family is closer it's the airports it's the airports okay uh, so this is the last question the chin the Chen family drives away from the beach at 10 a.m., driving at the same speed as the airports. So they are going away from the beach. So this is where they are at 10 a.m., and they're going away from the beach at the speed of 80 kilometers, because airports are driving at a speed of 80 kilometers. So what's the question? Draw the graph on Chen's, of the Chen's family on the same grid and work out airport when abort and chins both are the same distance from the beach so first let's draw the graph of chins so let me draw a line so if they're traveling at a distance of at a speed of 80 kilometers in four hours they would be 240 kilometers away at zero at time zero that means at 10 a.m they are at the beach and after four kilometers if they're driving at a speed of 80 kilometers they would be 240 kilometers uh two f no sorry they would be they would be two at after three hours they would be 240 kilometers because 80 times 3 is 240 so this would be the point sorry so this is the point i hope you understand they are starting at zero and in three kilometer three hours they would travel 240 kilometers so the line would look like this the line would look like this okay so this is for c this is for the chains okay so what's the equation of this line the equation of this line that is dc that is chain would be at c att plus zero att plus zero so so when are they meeting? So we have got DC is ATT. And just from looking at the graph, when are they meeting? They are meeting at one and a half hours. Okay? At 11.30 would be the answer. It does make sense here. Can you see? This is where they are meeting. Okay, this is where they meet each other. That is, this is 1.5. 1.5 means at 11.30 from looking at the graph. So let's do it graphically. So DA, this is DC for chin, would is my, minus ATT plus 240. So let's solve this. So we what we're asking is when is DC equal to DA? So you can say, well, ATT is equal to minus ATT plus 240. Okay, so adding 82 to both sides, 160T is equal to 240. So T would be 240 divided by 160, which is dividing both by 8, which is 3 over 2, which is 1.5. So what's the question? Draw the graph and work, work out when. Okay, so when the answer would be? At 11:30 a.m., they, they they would meet each other. 